Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Yes, I'm still sick. Um, I'm feeling better. I sound a lot worse than I am. I just need to get this filmed. I'm so behind on my videos. Because I've been sick, I haven't been posting. Um, because it's been hurting to talk and it's not hurting. It just sounds really gross. Um, but I have a ton of friend mail. I have an Ipsy bag. I still have my collab video that I need to do with a company that reached out to me and sent me some stuff that I need to review and like unbox. So I'm just behind. Um, so I just need to get through this. There's not a whole lot of food here. This is a Dollar Tree haul. A lot of this stuff is really awesome stuff that they're coming out with that I am going to be saving for stocking stuffers for my kids and Christmas gifts for other people and also for my ring bombs when I go live. But I'm going to keep this stuff for like Christmas time and you'll see what I mean by that. So I did get food, like I said, but not a whole lot. I've been sick. I need some more soup. I really like the Campbell's chicken noodle. They were all out of the chicken noodle, but I do like the chicken with rice soup. So I got two more cans. This is the 30% more. Um, it's the perfect size for me. I love this soup. I love having it in my pantry in case the kids are sick as well. Um, Leland wanted a little thing of Frosted Flakes. Shannon got Apple Jacks. She already ate it. Um, Leland wanted these mini chocolatey chip cookies. He said he did not like these. I did not try them because I don't feel good and I really don't want a cookie. Um, I'll let my husband try them. I'll let Shannon try them, see if they like them. If they don't, I can always just find someone else to give them, give them to. My husband's usually not picky about things like this, so I'm sure he'll eat them. And if I tell him that the kids didn't like them, he'll just take this whole box and leave it on his toolbox at work. So I've been drinking a lot of tea and I like to add a little bit of sugar to my tea and I'm completely out. So this is one of the reasons why I went today because I am completely out of sugar. Um, so I just got a little box. The hubby was with me. I went, we went to Dollar Tree yesterday. Um, because we also, he took me to breakfast. Even though I was sick, I was like, I, I didn't want to cook breakfast. We didn't have any eggs, so it's not like I could make the kids breakfast or anything like that. So he took us to breakfast and it was really good. And afterwards we went to Dollar Tree. And of course he was with me, so he picked up some candies. He did get a box of, sorry about that. Um, Hubby was with me, he got a box of the Reese's Pieces in the box. And then I saw these and I asked him if he wanted them. He said, sure. They are new Warheads cubes. He likes the galactic ones, um, but these are all blue raspberry. So I got a bag of that for him to try. The kids like Sweetest Fish and Friends. So do I, because you get watermelon, strawberry, and the original Swedish Fish. Last food item is two bags of the hard candy you guys know i pick these up for my ring bombs because i add two or three little pieces in the packages when they go out and i grab two so that way i have plenty i also got this reusable bag when i was in there this was hanging up in like the halloween stuff they also had a few other ones, but of course I chose Batman. I love that it's just black with the yellow symbol on there or the Batman logo. Um, so I'm thinking, I'm assuming they, they're trying to sell this as like a trick or treat bag, which it could work for that. Um, but I'm going to be using it for groceries and stuff. You guys know my husband loves Batman. So how to get Batman to represent the hubby. Um, only other Halloween thing I got was this and i'm actually gonna take the twine off of it i am gonna make a shirt for my mama she saw mine and that i made myself last year and she's like where's mine and i was like okay well let me get you a black shirt so i did go to walmart on thursday with deborah 
I did not do a haul. It was really small. I did get new black shirts for the kids and I got one for my mom. And I asked my mom if she wanted it to say trick or treat or Halloween. And the one that I had that I used last year was exactly like this, but it broke in half. So I had to throw it away. So I'm glad they were, st they still had them. I'm going to make myself a new shirt and it's going to say trick or treat. So that way I have one that says happy Halloween and trick or treat. I asked her what she wanted. She said she wants happy Halloween. The kids, I'll let them pick between this one or the trick or treat, or I'll just do whatever I want for the kids and I'll just give it to them. So that's what I got this for. Um, this is what you will put down on your shirt and then you will spray it with bleach. And then when you remove this, it leaves it. It's so cool and easy. So that's what I got that for because I need to make my mom and the kids one. I found this, it was on my wish list. Super excited. They do have a lavender one. I can't have lavender. But if you're all about that lavender, they do have a lavender one. This is the Yardley soap. This is name brand, you guys. They sell the Yardley bars of soap. But this is the moisturizing hand soap. This one's oatmeal and almond with almond essential oil. And it's 14 fluid ounces. Oh my God. Smells so freaking good. <coughs> so I did get one of those I didn't want to go crazy um, I have so much soap but I was on the hunt for this and I was so glad I finally found it I did get a package of cough drops these are just the best it says that they compare to the Halls defense these are the vitamin C ones I love the citrus ones I think there's the grapefruit is my favorite so I got a package of that because I am running low on my other cough drops. I got a package of the glowing facial wipes in orange peel. You get 32 in there by Bolero. And then I got a ton of chapsticks. You guys know I have a goodie bag for when people order for my ring bombs. They get to pick two items out of there. I'm not adding this stuff until the bag is closer to the end it has some new stuff in there I am going to save these for around Christmas time or I might use them as stocking stuffers to be honest with you so I did get two because I want to keep one of these for myself um I will show you guys a tour tour I need to do an updated version tour of my bathroom and I need to show you guys my purse tower because it is complete and it looks really cute so I want to put one of these in my purse tower with all my chapsticks that I have. So I got Lucky Charms. I grabbed two. Like I said, one for me, one for the goodie bag. And then I got Tricks. Again, I got two, one for me, one for the goodie bag. They had Nerds. They had Blow Pop. They had Mike and Ikes. They had a ton of different candies they had cocoa puffs leland got that one he did open it because he was sick so he also needed some chapstick um they they just they had a ton on a display so i did get those oh i also got this reusable bag it does say relax and it has the minions on there and I'm just going to use it for this stuff. I got two of these because this one is going to go in Shannon's stocking for Christmas. It is Stitch. It doesn't say what scent it is. Um, I think that's really weird that it doesn't say that. But it's pink. It has Stitch with some leaves on it. So that's gonna go in her stocking. I did get two. The other one's gonna go in the goodie bag. And then this one's gonna be for Leland because it has Baby Yoda. So these are gonna be for the kids, for their stockings. These are gonna be great stocking stuffers. The bath bombs that I got. And then I usually put socks and a stuffed animal. So that's usually what I do in their stocking. I don't go crazy. And I get one candy cane with like the M&Ms in it or the Mike and Ike's or whatever, and I hang that on the outside of their stocking.
because I don't like going crazy on in their stocking because they're already going to have so much presents to open. But I like putting a bath bomb, chapstick, um, sometimes I put hair ties in there for Shannon. A um, couple little other things, you know, like the little dinosaur blind box things. But I don't like going super crazy with their stocking. So that's what these are going to be for. And then I also got the blue Star Wars or blue wow the blue stitch he's hugging a pineapple it's so stinking cute again it doesn't say the scent or like the you know watermelon it doesn't say anything so i don't know um i read the back and they all say the same thing so there might not be a scent on it i don't know but i did get the blue one um i actually this one's actually going to be for leland has baby Yoda it's green really really cute so that'll be for him I don't think he'll care Mandalorian that one is gonna go in the goodie bag and so is this one so these are awesome to find at Dollar Tree it does say Disney on here they go for way more at Walmart and Target and stuff so I did get those and then when I was there today I saw these really cute Mickey Mouse coffee ones look at their little to-go coffee cups and they have little pom-poms on the lid this one is mint hot chocolate and it's green and then this one is candy cane candy cane swirl so I got two of each <coughs> so I did get those also for the goodie bag, I thought these would be really cute. Some people do like to add these on their phones. And if they want to use it for a stocking stuffer for one of their grandkids or nieces or nephews or kids or whatever, they can. These were the only three that they had. So they are rose gold. It's a phone ring with a strap. And it has a little glittery pom-pom ball. This one's white. This one is like a purpley rose gold color. And then this one is black with like a little bit of copper rose gold in it. I thought these were super cute. So those are gonna go in the goodie bag. So are these pens. I got the purple star. It is, um, dinner smells amazing. It's in the crock pot right now sorry but it is like textured you can feel it and it does have the little star confetti in there it's by jot so i did get the purple star the pink star these were the only three that they had i have seen a few other people do walkthroughs and and hauls of these so i know that there are more colors um and i will pick them up if i see them and i got the blue heart so i did get three of those I also got these ones. These are stylus pens. They have a flower at the top. It has the gems in here. It has the stylus, but when you twist it, the pen will come out. <coughs> so I got the pink, and then I got the darker pink fuchsia. <clears throat> Again, these were the only two I saw, so I did get those. I also got these stylus pens for the goodie bag. A lot of people like picking out pens. Um, these are also stylus. They have the crystals in there. This one is pink to purple to blue. This one's red to pink to a hot pink. So I did get those. Um, I don't know if these are gonna go in the goodie bag or if I'm gonna keep them. I haven't decided. They are by LA Colors. They are new shadow sticks. And this one is called Glycerine. And it's a really pretty coppery gold color. And this one is Retreat. And it's a really pretty rose gold. Like, I don't know. It's a little bit darker. But they, those are the two shades. They're really pretty. Again, I don't know if I'm keeping these or if I'm going to add them to the goodie bag. I will see. Um... 
Oops. I did find some new fabric. I am still selling um, trivets. These are some that I do not have. I found some white and black zebra print. And then I found this cheetah. And this is different. I do have a cheetah print, but it doesn't look like this. So that's why I went ahead and got this one. Um, Shannon does have homework. It's not real homework that you're thinking of. She's in kindergarten. She does know how to use scissors. Uh, she was taught in school how to do that. Um, and they specifically said they want us to just supervise and let them do it themselves. But a lot of my scissors are way too big for her. So I needed to get her a pair. So when she's doing her homework or whatever, she'll have a pair. These are for ages four and up. They are by Westcott. I just got pink. I wasn't necessarily looking for pink. I just grabbed the first one. So these will be for when she does her homework. And then I've been getting into journaling, like I said, and I found some different scissors. This one is sawtooth shape. So it shows you the design right there. This one is they're all sawtooth, but this one is a little bit different. Has a wavy line, like with a few less lines in it. This one's more like a zigzag. So I did get one of each that I saw for when I do my journaling. Also to go with my journaling, I found some stickers. I found these really pretty leaves. They are, you get nine of them and they are pop up. I, I do have sunflower stickers, but I do not have these ones. These are new to me anyways, and they are different. You get 10, they are also pop up. And then I went ahead and got the daisies with the ladybugs on there. Also, you get 11 in this one. I found these Disney princess stickers, which I wish I would have had these ones when I started my journaling, but that's okay. I can use these from now whenever I do it. Um, you get four sheets, but it does have all the princesses on there. And then it shows you on the back. So I got those. I have no idea what I am going to use this for, but it just says stickers. This one is black with silver cheetah. I'm sure I will find a DIY or craft to do with this. And then I picked up the gold and black tiger stripe. So I did get those. I was thinking of making pens with these but I don't know if it'll work because I don't know how thick this material is but we will see I did get those and then I also got some double-sided tape by crafter square I got these really cute ballpoint pens you get six these are the glittery ones I like using this green one in the middle right here for Halloween cards I also picked up these Jot ballpoint pens. You get 10 in each. I am doing something, so I need those. And then I also found these, and you only get eight, but they are a little different. And these are gel pens. So I did get those. Shannon wanted this, or Leland got this for his sister one of the days that he was with me. It's um, Shimmer and Shine Activity Kit you get two color ups, four markers, and four paint sheets. So it shows you on the back everything you get in there. And then the rest of this, you guys, is Christmas. And I was really excited to find some of this Christmas stuff because it was on my wish list. This sign is so stinking cute. I do not like hot cocoa. You guys know that. I am a coffee drinker, but this sign is everything. I love the buffalo check border. It says Christmas wishes and hot cocoa kisses. Like, I love the look of hot cocoa. I love how, like, I love how it looks, but I don't like hot chocolate. So I just thought this was super cute. I do want to hang this next to my coffee bar um, for Christmas time. And I had to get this one. He is so cute. And his nose 
is 3D. That's the only part, like his scarf is not, the tree right here isn't, the buttons aren't. And then it does have a metal snowflake. His hat says welcome. That is the only part that has glitter. But he is so cute. I love snowmen. You guys know that's my thing for Christmas is snowmen, candy canes, and penguins. So I love the red truck. I love the gnomes. But my original thing that I started doing for Christmas when I first started decorating was snowmen. That is my theme. I love them. I think they're so cute. I had to get this sign. And then I did find the village, you guys, and I'm so excited. I saw it on their website, and I was like, we're not going to get it. Because we never got the Halloween one that came out last year. Um, the little houses and everything for the fairy garden. My stores never got any of that. So this one says ice skating rink. It does have glitter on the roof. So there is this one. I did get two of these, I think, and it says let it snow, and it has a little snowman and a tree. I think I got two of those. Yeah, one for me, one for Deborah, because these were the last two, and I was like, I have to get her that. I don't think she does like a whole village, but she's obsessed with snowmen, so I had to get her that. I did get this one that looks like a little gingerbread house. But look at that. It's so cute. Look at the little peppermint up at the top. Oh my god, it's so adorable. I can't wait for Christmas. This one also says let it snow and it has the penguins in their igloo house. Look it. Oh my gosh. I love Halloween, but I'm like really excited for Christmas and I don't know why. I also got this one that's just like the little door. It's not a full-blown house. It's just the door the cute little barn oh my god I love it love it love it love it I do have a Christmas village so um I might give these to Deborah because they're smaller and she doesn't have a whole lot of room to decorate her house so I figured this would be really cute for her because I already have the igloo and I already have the bigger gingerbread so I'll see if she wants this. If not, I can save these. I can use them or I can give them to somebody or put them in a Christmas giveaway. But that's what I was thinking of these two. That's why I got them for her. And then there is this little arch that says welcome. There is a tree. There's this cute little bow right here. Super adorable. There is a light with a bow, a purple bow on it. There is a purple sleigh with some presents in it. It does have glitter. Super, super cute. And then I got this sleigh <coughs> that's just solid green. This one doesn't have glitter. It does have a tree in the back and presents. Oh, that one has a tree too, sorry. And then this is like a little bridge and it's purple. And then there's this one. So I figured like the purple stuff, you know, can go on my tear tray. And then like, this is more of a different feel, if you know what I mean. I mean, I, I might put it all together, I don't know. But I love this bridge with the wreath or like the garland hanging off of it. And then it has the snow at the bottom. So I was super excited to find this stuff, you guys. Like I said, I saw it on the website and I was like, we're not gonna get that. And I walked in and they had it and I was so excited, so I had to get it. All right, so that is it for this Dollar Tree haul. It wasn't very big, um, but I did wanna share it with you guys. I wanted to, I miss you guys. I, I'm planning on going live, I don't know when. Oh, I actually do have one more thing. Um, but the reason I have been gone is because I have been sick and like I said, it was just hurting to talk. It doesn't hurt as bad right now. I did get the kids a box of crayons. That was the other thing. It's just the original Crayolas. So I had to get those. Um, 
But like I said, I do have a Ipsy bag. I have friend mail. I have a package. I have some Halloween cards that I need to show you so that way I can put them up on the wall. And I did get a box. So I just wanted to share this with you guys, let you guys know what's going on. Um, I am going to be going live soon, hopefully in the next few days if I feel better. Um, but make sure you are, make sure you like this video, give it a big thumbs up, um, like, comment, subscribe. I would love for be, love for you to be a part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.